Imagine this, you are gearing up for a big tech interview and the dreaded question pops up. How do you handle complex algorithms? Now, if you are C-Sharp.net developer, you might be wondering if your choice of language puts you at disadvantage compared to C++ and Java and CS. Well, here's the truth. Mastering data structures and algorithms in C-Sharp can be your ticket to stand out in the competitive tech landscape. So why it is that some folk swear by C++ for DSA while other champion Java? And where does she shop fit into all of this? Let's get started. First off, let's chat about she shop and .NET. Why does learning DSA in this environment holds its own against Java or C++? She shop is a high level language that makes life a lot easier with its built-in libraries and features. For instance, .NET system.collection.generic library is treasure trove of pre-built data structures like lists, dictionaries, and queues. It's like having a toolbox that's always stocked with the exact tools you need. But here's the kicker. Many argue that because C-Sharp abstracts away some of the nitty-gritty details like memory management, it's not as good for learning DSA. Really? I would rather say this abstraction actually helps to focus more on solving problems rather than getting bogged down in low level details. Plus, using link to process data can make DSA problems look like a walk in the park. Now, let's pit C Sharp against Java in the DSA arena. Both languages are high level and have robust object oriented programming capabilities, but they come up with their own quirks. Java collection framework is a solid option, but C Sharp system.collection generic is equally powerful. Plus, C Sharp's integration with Visual Studio provides fantastic tool for de debugging and profiling which can make learning and applying DSA a smoother experience. So if you are a .NET developer, you are not missing out. You are actually in a pretty good spot. However, you might find more DSA resources for Java out there, but that doesn't mean C Sharp is lagging. As C Sharp grows in popularity, so does the wealth of resources tailored specifically for it. All right, let's get into the heavyweight C Sharp versus C++. C++ is the go-to for those who love to deep dive into memory management. If you are optimizing code for performance and really need to understand how data is handled at a lower level, C++ shines. But here's the rub. C Sharp's managed environment means less memory management. Some might say that it's a disadvantage, but it can actually make DSA learning more accessible. The garbage collector in C-Sharp takes care of memory for you. So you can concentrate on writing efficient algorithms without sweating over memory leaks. Moreover, for real world applications such as an enterprise solution or cloud-based app, the productivity benefits of C-Sharp often outweigh the performance gain of manual memory management. So while C++ might give you a speed boost, C Sharp ease of use and powerful libraries can help you to get the job done faster and with fewer headaches. Facing challenges while learning DSA in C Sharp, you are not alone. Some say C Sharp isn't suitable for DSA because it's high level and let's debunk that myth. One challenge is the perception that C Sharp isn't used for low level programming. But if you deep dive into link and make use of the system collection library, you will see that C Sharp can handle complex problems just fine. It's all about leveraging the tools and libraries at your disposal effectively. Here's a pro tip for you. Start with classic data structures like array and linked list. Then move on to the trees and graphs using practical examples from .NET projects such as implementing a binary source tree for efficient data retrieval can make your learning curve smoother. So why should you care about mastering DSA and C-Sharp? For one, top tech companies like Microsoft, Amazon are always on the lookout for developers who not only know their code but understand the underlying algorithm. 
Being proficient in DSA can set you apart in interviews and in your daily work. With the rise of cloud computing and enterprise solutions, C Sharp has become increasingly relevant. Companies are investing in .NET technologies, so having strong DSA skill in this language can be huge advantage. Here's what my prediction is: as technology evolves, the demand for developers who can efficiently solve algorithmic problems using modern languages like C Sharp will continue to grow. Embracing DSA in C Sharp today could mean better job prospects and more exciting opportunities in the near future. Why C Sharp is a great choice for DSA? The question is this. In summary, don't let anyone tell you that C Sharp isn't suited for learning DSA with its powerful libraries, supportive community, and practical applications. C Sharp is a fantastic choice for mastering data structures and algorithms. So if you are a .NET developer or thinking to deep dive into the C Sharp world, embrace DSA with confidence. It's not about the language you choose, but how you use it to solve problems effectively. Ready to sharpen your DSA skill in C Sharp? Start applying these concepts today and watch your coding power soar.